Hello friends. This video is brought to you by MyWayTeaching.com. Let us read the question. Given in the question are measures of some parts of two triangles. Examine whether the two triangles are congruent or not by using SAS congruency rule. If the triangles are congruent, write them in symbolic form. Let us draw a rough figure of the triangle and mark the information given. We have AB as 7 cm, BC as 5 cm and angle B is given as 50 degrees. And for triangle DEF, we are given DE equal to 5 cm, EF equal to 7 cm and angle E equal to 50 degrees. Here clearly we can see in the two triangles AB is equal to EF equal to 7 centimeters. Also BC is equal to DE equal to 5 centimeters and angle B is equal to angle E and it is 50 degrees. That means angle included between the equal sides are equal and hence triangle ABC is congruent to triangle FED by SAS property. We expect you to understand that why we are writing FED as the correspondence would be that A should correspond to F, B should correspond with E and C should correspond with D. Let us proceed with the second part of the same question. Following dimensions are given for triangle ABC and for triangle DEF. We have drawn the rough figures for both the triangles. Now clearly in both the triangles we have AB equal to FD and AC is equal to DE but the angles included between the equal sides are not equal as angle A is not equal to angle D so we can say that the two triangles are not congruent by SAS property. We have drawn a rough figure of triangle ABC with the given dimensions and triangle DEF with the given dimensions in the question. Clearly from the figure BC is equal to EF and AC is equal to DF. Also angle B is equal to angle E but angle B is not the included angle between the equal sides. So we can say that SAS congruency rule cannot be applied and 
the two triangles are not congruent. Let us read the question. In the given figure, AB equal to AC and AD is the angle bisector of angle BAC. Firstly, state three pair of equal parts in triangle ADB and ADC. Clearly, in the two triangles, we can see that AB is equal to AC which is given, AD equal to AD as it is the common side and angle BAD is equal to angle CAD as AD is given to be the angle bisector. And clearly from this information we can see that Triangle ADB is congruent to triangle ADC and hence we have solved the second part of the question. Now the third part is, is angle B equal to angle C? Give reason. Then clearly, since the two triangles are congruent by SAS property, we have angle B equal to angle C as these are corresponding parts of the congruent triangle.